party members convened at the Legacy House in Abuja and led by the party chairman made their way on foot to the INEC headquarters. It's been an interesting few weeks for the People's Democratic Party since the elections of the 23rd of February. And since then, the party officials have minced no words in communicating their disappointment with the results returned by INEC stating categorically that those results will be challenged in court. What ground are you This protest, however, has another element to it. The party wants the military to stay away from the polls, which are to hold on the 9th of March, as they allege that the military was used to rig the elections on the 23rd of February. After a short wait, party officials are met by officials of INEC, and the chairman of the party states their demands. Sir, we have come to register our protest, the involvement of the military in the exercise of election by INEC. We have also come to register all parts of the country from the north to the south, the rigging and the manipulations that took place. We have the right to do so. And we are challenging your declaration in the court, so we don't have any problem with that. But moving forward, is that what you are going to do on the 9th? The presidential candidate of um, uh, PDP, myself as the national chairman and members of my working committee, are being intimidated every day by EFCC. Is that how politics is being played? After accepting the petition by the party, INEC addresses the party officials. INEC has received your complaints. We're going to look at it critically. Where we have to change, we'll change. But where it belongs to others, we'll come together and work together. And I believe that on Saturday, the elections are going to go on very, very well. well looking all for... we ask is that for your own sake too, your mantra should be peace. It's peace. They are making allegations of militarization during the election, uh, accusations of rigging during the elections, and they are demanding that on the 9th of March that none of that repeats itself, and they are also uh, contesting the results of the elections on the 23rd in court, and they are saying that is a done deal, they will not give up without a fight. Kayla Magua, Channels Television News.